Hey everybody, my name is Nick, and uh, I'm from. I'm originally from Ukraine. I just moved here like a month ago, so please pardon my English. And I still have machine gun in my backpack. So, oh. <laughs> all right. Um, so as you know, Ukraine is all about revolutions. And uh, when we we started thinking about presentations, we we're like, okay, the presentation tool have not has not been changed like since. Uh, 1995, and we thought, okay, we, we really sh should uh, do something here. So we developed this tool that, that is called Presentane. Uh, we didn't care uh, much about branding at that time, but yeah, sorry. Uh, anyway, so let me show you how it works. Presentane helps speakers engage the audience by making their presentations interactive. So how do I do it? I use my smartphone as a smart clicker. So now you can get rid of your hardware clicker, all the problems that, that, uh, that come with it. And uh, you can use your uh, either iPhone or Android in order to switch the slides. So I use these two buttons over here to be able to switch the slides. I also have uh, like current slide and next slide, so I know uh, how to bridge to the next slide. I can also scroll this stuff over here and jump to the slide that I want to uh, jump to. So you don't have to like click multiple times to get to the last slide or to get to uh, like a couple of slides back. So uh, where is engagement, you will ask me, right? So engagement starts when you as, as audience are able to get connected to my presentation. So you can actually do it, pull out your smartphones, tablets, laptops, whatever you have, and enter this URL here. It's presentain.com slash 6216. They say you cannot do demos uh, on your presentations, but yeah, we'll try it. <laughs> so it's presentain.com slash 6216. The URL will be always on top over there. Uh, it's quite, kind of small, but anyway, so it's 6216. All right? Do you have it ready? Raise your hand if you have that ready on your phone or, or tablet. Okay, so I'll show it again. So it's presentain.com, 6216, all right? Let's hope that uh, you will have it loaded. So what you have in your screen is uh, what we call audience dashboard. And that's the thing that you basically use to be able to interact with me during the presentation. So let's take a look. So the first thing you can do, you can uh, click on, on my face. This is actually my co-founder's face, but <laughs> hopefully you will have my, my face on your device. So when you click on that, you'll be able to watch my profile, see my uh, social profiles. If you're like coming to, the, to a presentation like, okay, who's this guy? I never heard of him. You can check what I tweet about, whether it's like, you know, cats and dogs or something, or it's IT. And you can decide where, whether you want to stay uh, for, for the presentation or not. Then, the next thing that you can do, you can ask a question. So right now, how it's done, either it's a, it's a, it's a girl or a lady that is running around with a microphone, or you, you ask me a question and I have to repeat it. So right now, you text that question, and I receive all of the questions on my phone over here. So if you have a question right now, or you will, you will have a question, then just type it in, and I'll receive it on my phone. I, okay, I start receiving those. So what I, <laughs> what I can do, I can actually review them before answering, if you care about that feature, uh, uh, and, uh, and I get to decide when to answer and what, what to answer. Um, then what you can do, you can view current slide on your, on your device. So sometimes it happens that, okay, I'm shown some very interesting chart. And you're like, oh, geez, I was, I was looking for this chart like for a couple of, couple of years. And, and, and now it's on the screen, and then, boom, I switch to the next slide. And you're like, oh, no. And you would see people making a photo of the slide or, you know, things like that. So right now, what you can do, you can watch the same slide that's on a big screen on your devices as well. You can also share it in your social networks. Actually, you can go back to the previous slide if you would like to be able to spend more time with the previous slide that I skipped. Also, oh, seven questions, I'm gonna answer them. Um, so I can do real-time polling with, with you, and this is really exciting, because we, we had this demo day in Amsterdam last year, and we had um, Her Majesty Queen Maxima in, in, uh, in the room as well, as well as like three, 350 corporate investors, with, you know, with stone faces, you know, you, you should do like an icebreaker or something. What, what kind of icebreaker can you do to that kind of audience, right? So we had this question that was really fun. 
And I'm, I'll try to do the same thing with you right now. So, the question uh, will appear over here. Do you like it so far? And on your devices, you will get answer options. So as you start voting for this, we will see the chart appearing that shows the answers. That's kind of fun. So everybody likes it, right? So it's okay. Good. Ooh. Oh. Nice. 100% success. All right. <laughs> Nick, unfortunately, we're out of time. This is awesome. Would you mind uh, going into the Q&A? Oh, yeah, yeah, for sure. Yeah, yeah. So the last thing, that, uh, just a couple of minutes. I mean, just one minute. <laughs> That's what they always say. So what we do, what we do as well, we record the voice. So you can see that I'm holding my iPhone upside down. If you can see that, that's because I want the microphone to be closer to my mouse. And what, what we do, we record the voice. And guys, you will be amazed by the quality that this thing can do. And we record the clicks. So if you would like to get the recording of this presentation, you can, on your devices, you can type in your email address on the bottom of the screen. It says request presentation recording. Just type in your email address and you will get, like in a matter of seconds after I finish the presentation, you get the recording. And I get your email address. So, and then you have a profile page and everything. All right, and then after the presentation, of course, I have like, like this dashboard of all the statistics about the presentation, how many, how many people connected, what kind of leads did I generate, what kind of people requested my, uh, my recording, um, and other uh, useful statistics, and of course, the, the recording. Okay, so we have... Nick, I'm carrying you off the stage now. Okay, oh, oh, no, no. Okay, so uh, questions, questions. So the first question, I don't have to repeat it actually. You can see it on your devices as well. So we have a little bug over there. So the question is all over there. So it says, uh, is it in beta? It is actually not in beta. It is stable and live. Um, you can use the button called request follow up to be able to send me a message and I will grant you access to this thing, all right? Or get, just go to presentain.com and register for free. Uh, what is your revenue model? Of course. Um, so, so the, um, so we are we are actually going to B two C and B two B. So B two B B two C is uh, it's a subscription based model. We have freemium. So um, and for free you get like five presentations in the system and three recordings and three polls. And then if you want to lift off those those limitations, you have to pay like nine ninety nine per month and twenty four ninety nine per month. Okay. Okay. So this one. How are you marketing this? So I'm marketing it like this. <laughs> so, so we actually we actually pretty bad at marketing. Sorry, uh, we we I have a software background uh, because we together with my partner we started a software development company like ten years ago, and we we grew it to a number of. Uh, 100 employees or more and we're like ah we're sick and tired of the service model because it's red race you know constant red race you have to find clients then you do a project then it's coming to an end and then it starts all over again so we started doing uh, products and the first thing that software guy does when when uh, he's about to develop a product he develops a product <laughs> And so we didn't, you know, we didn't do any of the like uh, market research. Uh, we didn't do any experiments and everything. We just, you know, straight ahead. We just developed the product, and now we're trying to see what kind of problem does it solve. <laughs> so it's kind of upside down, but yeah, it's it's uh, so far it's a very good experience. So how we market that? Uh, we haven't started yet. Yeah. All right, let's give a round of applause for me and President